Hi, my name is Jill Matson, and Bonnie asked me to pick one of my favorite books that I've recently read, but is also available on Audible, and it's called Open by Andre Agassi. Not a new book, but I found it at a flea market in upstate New York and started reading it last summer. And the first page, I put the book down and I said to everyone, this is, I love this book so much. So I want to start with one of the things that got to me on the first page. It says, uh, my name is Andre Agassi. My wife's name is Steffi Groth. We have two children, a son and a daughter, five and three. We live in Las Vegas, Nevada, but currently reside at a suite at the Four Seasons Hotel in New York City because I'm playing in the 2006 U.S. Open, my last U.S. Open. In fact, my last tournament ever. I play tennis for a living, even though I hate tennis, hate it with a dark and secret passion and always have, which is pretty amazing. But what's even more amazing is when I pulled the book out today, this is just so ironic and so timely. So this is what I want to read to you. He starts off with this quote from Vincent Van Gogh, a letter to Vincent Van Gogh's brother from July 1880. And it says, one cannot always tell what it is that keeps us shut in, confines us, seems to bury us, but still one feels certain barriers, certain gates, certain walls. Is all this an imagination, fantasy? I do not think so. And then one asked, my God, it is for long, it is forever. It, is it for eternity? Do you know what frees one from the captivity? Is it the very deep, serious affection? Being friends, being brothers, love, that is what opens the prison by supreme power, by some magic force. I just thought, wow, that is so ironic. Anyway, I, it's an old book but such a treat to read.